Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are gonna be styling up some spring outfits. When we were in Florida this past month on our anniversary trip, I got so excited to style up some warmer weather outfits. I feel like I have been bundled up all year and getting to break out my shorts and my tanks in Florida was just the best thing ever. So it got me really pumped to show you guys some outfit ideas for spring. Right now in Nashville, we're still in that weird like in between winter and spring season where it can be really cold one day, warm the next day. So I have a variety whether you are in 80 degree weather or warmer, or if you're kind of like us and you're, you have spurts of really nice weather. If you are new to my channel though, I will have everything that I can linked down below in the description box. I have a mixture of stuff that's current and then stuff that I've had in my wardrobe for a while. So be sure to check out everything down below in the description box if there's anything that catches your eye. But let's go ahead and get into this first look. So for this first look, I really wanted to carry over some stuff that I got during the winter into spring because I feel like some of the stuff can be really easily transitioned into the warmer months, especially if you are in a climate like Nashville where, you know, during the day it's really nice out, but in the morning and at night it can get kind of cold. So I've got on this knit set from Everlane. They had this in a few different colors. I think it actually might be on sale at this point, but they launched this around Christmas time and I didn't get a ton of wear out of it just because it is sleeveless so I wanted to kind of bring it into spring and I think this is the perfect way to transition those cute like knit loungewear sets into warmer weather so I've paired it with this amazing tweed white button-down shirt from Abercrombie this is current so I'll link it down below I think I sized up in this because I wanted it to be a little bit of a looser fit but this shirt has honestly gotten so much wear already I've already worn this every single day basically of my trip for my anniversary because it is just the perfect thing to throw over really anything. You can throw it over a tank top, you can throw it over a dress, you can wear it with shorts, with jeans, you can button it up and like tuck it in. There's a lot of ways that you can wear a white button down and this one specifically is really great though because it's a thicker material so it feels almost like a really, really lightweight jacket. Like it's a little bit thicker than your normal cotton white button up shirt. So I really like it in that sense. And then for my shoes, I've just got on my Birkenstocks. I think these are honestly the best shoes ever. I wore them the whole trip while we were in 30A. And I know they're super casual, but I feel like it kind of tones down the full on matching purple set like the purple set itself is kind of like a statement and so for my shoes i wanted to keep it super casual so i've got on my burks they go with literally everything if you don't have a pair of birkenstocks i joined so late on birkenstocks like i know they've been around forever people in high school were wearing them all the time and i never really understood the birkenstock shoe but now that i have tried them i'm obsessed with them so these are such a staple in my wardrobe right now and then i've got on this hobo bag I love this like dumpling shaped bag. I feel like these became really trendy over the last couple of years and Hobo just came out I think with some spring colors as well. So I will link this bag down below, but I really like the neutral. I think it's just very casual, it's slouchy, and then it also does have a crossbody strap if you wanna wear it a little bit longer. But this is my first outfit. Like I said, we're trying to bring stuff from winter into spring so that we get some more wear out of it during the next season. So this next outfit is super casual as you guys could probably tell. It's just a really great pair of denim. So these are the Madewell Perfect Vintage Straight Jean. I believe these are current, so I'll link these down below, but they have so many different variations of the Perfect Vintage Jean. If you've been around on my channel for any amount of time, you know I'm obsessed with these jeans from Madewell. They fit so well. They also come in tall and petite, which is amazing because I am five foot two. I don't know if I mentioned that earlier, but I'm five foot two for reference. So I'm more on the short side. I think these fit so well. I love the distressing and the hole in the knee and they just fit everywhere really, really nicely. So with these jeans, I've got on an Abercrombie bodysuit. I have been loving Abercrombie lately. They have so many 
really good basics, but also very trendy pieces. And I think it's perfect for spring. And the best part is that it's a bodysuit. So you don't have to worry about it coming untucked. It is super flattering. I love the neckline on this piece. And I really like the fitted top with a straight leg jean. I feel like it's a really good kind of balance of silhouettes. And then for my shoes, I've got on a pair of Dolce Vita sandals. These are a white or cream woven sandal. They have so many great sandals right now. I'll link a few of my favorites down below. But these ones are definitely some of my favorites. They are flat, so they're super comfortable to wear all day. And they have a little bit of that like puffy design that's really trendy right now. My Gucci Gigi Marmont bag, I decided to keep this one around because I love how you can just kind of throw it on. It's more durable than my Chanel double flap and I feel like it actually might get some wear this spring and summer. So I'm really excited to have that bag around. And then for my sunglasses, I just got these off of Amazon. These are some really affordable frames. Came in a two pack. We got these and then a pair that are a little bit brown and tortoise as well. And I think I got both of them for like $16. So I'll link those down below. I love this shape of frame right now. I think it's super on trend and they're just a really flattering frame on a lot of faces. So I'll have all of these accessories down below in the description box as well. But this is the second look. This next outfit is definitely one of my favorites. I just ordered a bunch of dresses from Old Navy and I'll have my Old Navy try on haul linked down below in the description box if you wanna see everything that I got. But this blue dress is one of my favorites that I got. I also got it in white. I think it's just a really, really flattering silhouette and I actually got it in petite, which I was shocked by because I didn't know Old Navy actually carried petite. So I was really excited to style this with these white boots. I got these from Alohas and and they are so cute. They're this beautiful off-white. They're almost like an ivory and they have the most amazing brown heel. I love the two-tone and I think wearing a really high boot like this is perfect for fall and spring because you can wear them with your favorite dresses. And so I've got it with the Free People crossbody bag that I got in December. Again, I'm trying to use some of those pieces that I got during winter and bring them kind of into warm weather. So the boots and the bag I actually got in the middle of winter and I'm really excited to wear it this season. This next look, I definitely would envision if you're running errands or you're exploring a new city. I am obsessed with the Abercrombie denim shorts. They have so many different washes and distressings and so many different styles of this specific pair. So I'll link these down below. This is a new two-tone knit tee from Abercrombie as well. And I've got on my favorite Madewell sneakers. These are the court sneakers and they actually just released these in purple and green so I love the little pop of color on the shoe they're so comfortable I wear them to walk around kind of all day so I think this is the perfect outfit for biking around going on walks going to the park all that stuff it's very very casual but at the same time I feel like this two-tone top gives it a little bit of an edge and then for my bag I've got on an Everlane crossbody bag I'm not sure if this is current anymore but if it is I'll link it down below I love this bag though because it feels very very casual it's super lightweight and I love the whole like seatbelt strap style the really thick strap I think is very trendy for my sunglasses I've got on these round frames from Madewell I believe these are still available but I love these because they have the nose pieces so if you have a flatter nose like I do these are ideal plus they are lower in the price point so you don't have to really worry about them getting damaged if you want to wear them like in the swimming pool or anything like that so this is my kind of out and about very casual fit so if you're ever needing a really quick and easy outfit for a beach dinner or a night out or you just wanna look really springy, I definitely think a pair of white denim is a must have. If you don't have a pair of white denim, I would highly suggest grabbing some. These are the perfect vintage jean from Madewell, again, in white. And I get so much wear out of white denim during the spring and summer. I think it's just such an easy way to look very put together, but also white goes with literally everything. So if you're looking for a really easy hack, seriously just throw on like a blue top or a blue button down and it feels very like 30A beachy vibes. This top is actually from Abercrombie and it is a cropped kind of blouse and I think it looks so good because it hits right at the top of the jeans so you don't have to actually tuck anything in which is super nice. It also has these really big puffy sleeves and a really nice 
floral pattern. I believe it also comes in a few different colors as well. For my shoes, I've got on the Alohas heels. I got these a while ago, but they actually still carry them at Madewell, so I'll link them down below. I've gotten so much wear out of these heels already because they seriously match everything. They also have a really thick kind of block heel, so they're super comfortable to walk around in. My bag is Palen, and this one is so beautiful. I feel like it's the perfect size for summer because it's on the smaller side. I also love this specific shade of brown and the texture of this bag. I think it's just a really beautiful, beautiful handbag. And then for my sunglasses, these are the other sunnies that came in that pair from Amazon. These are the brown kind of tortoise ones, and I'm obsessed with these sunglasses. They are so seriously so sleek. So this next outfit is definitely Nashville appropriate. I've got this amazing long cardigan on. This one is perfect because it's super lightweight even though it's a cardigan duster. It is a really really thin one so it's great for throwing on over a tank top and some jeans and then if it gets warmer during the day you can just remove your cardigan and you have a really sleek look. I love these jeans from Abercrombie. These are some of their like trending viral jeans. I can't remember what they're called but I will have them down below in the description box and then I've got it on with this seamless fabric bodysuit from Abercrombie as well and then for my shoes I wanted to kind of match the beige on beige and so I've got on my Celine boots that I got during the winter again I really wanted to bring in some of the clothes that I got during fall and winter and kind of carry it over into spring to get some more wear out of them plus I feel like you can definitely wear booties into spring so for this last look I've got on a slip dress this one is from Old Navy and I love this one because it's purple and I think it's so fun for spring and I really wanted to pair it with one of my new sweaters so this one is from Madewell and it also is like a really pretty dusty purple I love throwing sweaters over dresses because it changes the look completely so if you're feeling stuck on how to wear your favorite dresses you can always throw any sort of top or sweater on over it and make it you know kind of look like a skirt so it's a whole new look and then I've got it paired with my Dolce Vita sandals these are the same white ones I had on earlier and this Madewell bag so these are all of my spring outfits I hope you guys enjoy this video grab some ideas from my outfits if you like these types of videos please be sure to give it a thumbs up leave me a comment down below let me know what your favorite outfit was from this entire video and if you're new here and you want to stick around for some more styling videos be sure to hit that subscribe button I would love to have you back on my channel and I will see you guys in my next one really really soon bye guys Bye.